Well, Motherwell will remember their first visit here last season. At half-time it was 0-0. At full-time, 5-0 to Rangers. A Gascoigne hat-trick and a Loudrup double. And both are playing this afternoon. And of course, uh, last time Motherwell were here, uh, they caused a real upset uh, on Rangers' party day for nine in a row. Now it's Faulkner. Looking for Coin. It's clear by Vidmar. Martin's there ahead of Negri. Shivute. That breaks through now for Coyne. Good play by Tommy Coyne. Superb goal by Tommy Coyne with seven minutes gone here at Ibrox. Well, what a season this man is having. It was brilliant forward play there because he held off the challenge of Wiedmark. He got in behind the defence. He managed to hold off the challenge and a good finish under Andy Gorham. Shavute it was who knocked it through. Just watch Coyne here. Great forward play, holding off Wiedmark, using his strength, and great finish. Rangers nil, Motherwell one. Well, Bjorklund sends that one right to Christie. Your challenges, Gattuso wins it. This is Miller, he's held back there. Advantage is allowed, here's Negri, round the goalkeeper, he's forced wide up. Great finish. Again, it's Marco Negri. It's his 16th goal of the season, and what an angle he had to score that one from. The goalkeeper forced him wide, the defender was with him, and he still managed to get this one into the back of the net. Great pace by him, good play by the goalkeeper, and even though Martin was getting there, that is a great finish from a tight angle. It's Rangers 1, Motherwell 1 after 17 minutes here at Ibrook Stadium. We're inside the final minute of this first half here at Ibrook Stadium. So Brian Martin to take this one. So on the way to the far side for Faulkner who gets a touch on it. It's another one for Motherwell. It's Shavute who scores. He gets his first goal since joining the club. In the final seconds of this first half. Rangers 1, Motherwell 2, the ball swung away to the far post and Willie Faulkner is always a threat out there, he got a good touch back across goal and the Rangers defence absolutely caught here Faulkner with the touch and then Shavuti way beyond Andy Gorham Rangers 1, Motherwell 2, right on half time and that has stunned Ibrox into silence Brian Martin it was who picked out Faulkner And a good finish. Good play by Gascoigne, getting away from Valicari. Picking out Stensis. Better play this by Rangers. Still at Stensis, away to the far side. Gordon Juris coming in. And McMillan did just enough there. Well, and returns it. Gattuso! And it's another very good stay by Stevie Woods. Rio Gattuso looking for his first goal. And diving in bravely there. Good save by the goalkeeper. That's three excellent saves in this game from Stevie Woods. Albert sends it in this time. And it's Sergio Porini. With 64 minutes gone, he gets his first goal for Rangers. Well, that goal's been coming from Porini for a long time in this match. He's been forward for all the set pieces. He's been pushing forward at every opportunity. And if one Rangers player deserves a goal, it's Sergio Porini. Good header, beyond the goalkeeper, Rangers 2, Motherwell 2. This is another chance here for Rangers, it's Stensis. The high one into the middle, Negri's going for it. And good clearance there. It was Denham who got it away. An important clearance that for Motherwell. Well, Motherwell are unbeaten away with successive wins at Dunfermline and Aberdeen. We're just seconds away from a very good result here at Ibrook Stadium. We've played three minutes of stoppage time. The whistle sounds. Alec McLeish is the happier manager. And there's a hero of the afternoon, Stevie Woods, with some outstanding saves in both the first half and second half. But he was beaten in the end by Sergio Perini after 64 minutes as a cross came in. A very good header from the Italian. The final score here at Ibrook Stadium is Rangers 2. Mother will too.
I think it was quite a lucky goal and a good finish. I mean, it's not that easy to start. I mean, my career here with these tough teams like Celtic and Rangers, it's quite a high start, but I'm trying my best to cope with it and hope to do much better, I mean, in the games to come.